can you create a better culture in your organization? Welcome to Build a Better Career. In this video, I'm going to talk about some actions you can take to help create a better culture in your organization and how and why doing that can help you build a better career. Hello, I'm Diane Bogino. And if this and other topics like this sound of interest to you, then hit that subscribe button. When I worked in human resources in the hospitality industry, employees would complain that our leadership would see team members in a hallway, pass by them and never speak or acknowledge them. No good morning, no good afternoon, no, hey, how are you doing? I found that to be disturbing and disappointing because our training programs taught that a staff member would never pass by a guest and not greet them. In fact, in hospitality, we have a rule called the 10 and 5 rule. Now, the 10 5 rule helps ensure that whenever a guest is within 10 feet of a hotel staff member, the hotel staff member must make eye contact with a warm and sincere smile to acknowledge the guest. Now, this technique makes you acknowledge the guest presence and helps the guest to know that you are giving them the attention they deserve. Next, when a hotel staff member comes approximately within five feet from a guest, a sincere verbal greeting along with a friendly gesture of acknowledgement, such as a head nod, should be there along with that eye contact and that warm, sincere smile. You may be asking, what's the point? Well, while you may not see guests or customers like people in a hotel do, you still have internal customers, which takes us back to the original idea of having a culture where people don't feel obligated to speak to coworkers. That's how toxic cultures begin. When people feel good about what they do for a living, it leads to better overall well being. Persistent engagement, such as the 10 5 rule, leads to positive work related emotions like enthusiasm and happiness. It also helps form stronger relationships. And by using and modeling the 10 5 rule, you can help strengthen your organizational culture for the better. In addition, if you are a leader, it's your responsibility to keep your workforce engaged, connected, and optimistic. Even if you're not a member of the C-suite yet, consistently acknowledging others by using the 10-5 rule can showcase your professionalism, improve your business relationships, help you stand out as a true team player, and serve to illustrate that you are leadership material and ready to join the C-suite. Thank you for watching and please support this channel by giving this video a thumbs up and subscribe so you won't miss any of my videos to help you showcase your leadership skills and build a better career. Let's get started.